There are several events that are upcoming for Louisville Beer Week. Some are educational and some involve your pets. We'll get to that just in just a minute. But, Michael, um, we're talking about the Louisville Ale Trail putting on this year's Louisville Beer Week. What can we look forward to? Yeah, Beer Week is the 22nd through the 29th. All the breweries are doing a bunch of different collabs, beer releases, doing events like you said. We have a history panel, a women in beer panel. Uh, and then actually two of the events are going to be hosted by PG&J's Dog Park Bar, uh, one with High Wire and then one with Against the Grain. Gina, we have dogs in costumes here. Talk to me a little bit about what we can expect with, for your Beer Week events. Yes, so we have a ton of activities happening. This Saturday is actually our first Barktoberfest. And then the following weekend, we have a Puppaween Halloween costume parade partnered with High Wire. Then we have our Tricks for Treats that Saturday, and then a costume contest sponsored by Against the Grain on Halloween. And you guys are making sure that you're, you're keeping causes close to your heart. Talk to me about the um, that part of this uh, this event. Sure, so we actually sponsor five local rescue organizations, and so a portion of all sales are donated to them at the end of our first year of operations. And then we do little things like donations and raffles and things like that that we can raise money just to help save lives. And how does it feel to have all of these great organizations and local breweries coming together for this big week? I love the breweries that are getting involved. Obviously, that's been the case for the last few years. But uh, now we're really trying to get more organizations, more community members into the fold as well. All right. Well, Louisville Beer Week starts on Friday. So make sure you head out to your local craft breweries and support them. And then it lasts an entire week. So you have plenty of time to get in on the fun. Alex Durham, WLKY News.